let's talk about wave pulses in physics a pulse is a single disturbance that moves through a medium from one point to the next point when the pulse reaches the end of that medium what happens it is actually depends on the medium whether it is fixed in space or free to move at this end you can see a pulse where a human is there and is trying to oscillate a thread and you can find the velocity that is the speed of the pulse over here according to pulse pulse waves are nothing but the waves that consist of a single traveling pulse you can find here the single traveling pulse you can see here as well and in terms of periodic wave is nothing but waves that continue to generate pulses this was actually a single traveling pulse and this was actually the periodic wave where the wave is continuing to generate its pulse here so wave pulses are categorized as in this way let's talk about wavelength so what is wavelength the speed of a wave equals to the frequency times the wavelength is the wavelength and frequency of light are closely related to the higher frequency and shorter the wavelength so you can find the wavelength of a wave here and this is the example depiction from this because of light waves move through a vacuum at the same speed the number of wave crests passing by a given point in one second depends on the wavelength so you can see in the x axis we have the position and in the y axis we have the wave function that is stated as ym over here you can find the number of wave crest that is passing by a given point in one second this is all because of the specification of how the wavelength will be calculated in terms of velocity at x axis and this is nothing but the measurement of point for the frequency v Now let's talk about transverse and longitudinal waves again. A transverse wave has its oscillations perpendicular to the direction of the wave moves. Whereas the longitudinal wave has oscillation in the same direction as the wave moves. You can find here the depiction of the longitudinal wave and the transverse waves. Transverse waves vibrate at right angles to the direction of the travel of the wave this is the wave direction and this is the vibration which is happening light and radio waves or transverse waves let's discuss about waves in motion waves have crest and trough the crest of a wave is sometimes called a wave front and the shape of the wave is determined by its wave front so this is the wave in which it's moving on and you can find an example over here there is a stick and this is the source and destination point of how the stick is tends to be moving upwards down with a slip So this is one such example of waves that is in motion.